After a tough loss in the title fight against Merab Devalishvili at UFC 306, Sean O'Malley has officially announced his decision to take a step back from the octagon. O'Malley, who had been aiming to solidify his dominance in the bantamweight division, expressed that the defeat took a toll on him both mentally and physically. As a result, he has decided to take a full-on break from fighting, indicating that he may be away from the sport for up to a year. This break will allow him to recover, reassess his career and return stronger, with fans eagerly awaiting his eventual comeback. People, I mean, yeah, I probably won't fight. I probably won't fight till for nine months, ten months, maybe a year. Like, it's going to be a while. People are going to have to watch the UFC without the Sugar Show for a little bit, but... Then maybe they'll realize, like, ah, fuck. We had the, mm -hmm. we had it. It was fun. It's going to feel good to take a legit break to get fully healthy, full on break without something like, oh, this is next. I don't have anything. Nothing scheduled. I don't want to even, it's like no one's next. I got to get healthy and that's it. Take my time and come back. Ah. Merab Devalishvili reflects on winning the UFC bantamweight title and explains the situation behind why he kissed Sean O'Malley's back. He wrote on Twitter, wanted to explain also what happened during fight when I got O'Malley in the choke. I heard 10 seconds and knew I didn't have enough time for a submission, so I decided to show him who the daddy was of this fight and gave his back a few kisses laugh out loud. When the ref touched me, I thought it was break time, so I started walking to my corner. But there were still three seconds he was just telling me to stop kissing him last.